Hi Leo, welcome back guys. I hope you all are doing well today. This is gonna be for anybody with Leo placements in their charts. Make sure you are flipping, you switch the roles. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't fit for your situation, guys. Thank y'all so much for your love, your supports, your donations, and your super chat, super thanks. The love never goes unnoticed, and I'm returning that to you all tenfold. Um, anything you guys need to know about me is gonna be down below in the description box. And please be aware of the fake pages that are on here and on any other social media platforms, okay? So let's see, Leo. Let's see. Spirit guides, angels, ancestors, ascended masters, gods and goddesses. Please return any spell work, any dark magic that is sent to harm. Leo and their loved ones, me and my loved ones, return it back to the center. Block any interferences that could be stopping the messages from coming through. Clear, concise, and precise messages from my Leo collective. And protect me as I channel the messages for Leo. Let's see. What's going... Uh, I'm about to say what's going through. <laughs> what you going through, Leo? What's going on for my Leos here? So we have imposter. Okay, fraud, stolen identity, and faking it. So... We have savage in the reverse, acting ruthless, inconsiderate of others, no fucks given. SOS, distress, act with urgency, assistance needed. Sorry, not sorry. Unremorseful, avoiding accountability, neglecting responsibility. Mm. Chained. Codependency, unhealthy attachment, way, way down. Okay. <laughs> I, I feel like <clears throat> somebody could actually be getting ready to go to the hospital for something. Somebody could like be calling for backup for some shit. Like, what is going on here? <laughs> um, somebody. Mm -hmm. Somebody could be sick, Leo. I feel like you're in this energy where you're kind of like leaving something behind and you don't give a fuck about how nobody feeling right now or what's going the fuck on with somebody. Okay, let's see. What's this imposter here? The sun reversed. Leo energy could be another Leo. I always get another distorted Leo in your energy somewhere. King of Souls reverse. But what's imposter? Mm, the Ace of Swords coming out first. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. So some sort of truth and clarity is coming through. Okay, you could be getting truth or clarity that somebody is is fake. They're an imposter. They're a fraud. They really don't know what they act like they know or. They could be trying to act like somebody that you're involved with or they're trying to act like you. You're finding out that somebody's like trying to be you, okay? Or trying to do something. What's impossible with the Ace of Swords? Or somebody here, okay, you're a magician. Somebody has a lot of clarity here around an imposter. Virgo, Gemini. Or somebody's trying to live the life that you're supposed to be living. They trying to swap places with you and shit like that. The Ace of Swords and the Magician is a lot of mental clarity. Definitely on your your psychic your psychic abilities are also heightening, amplifying, or you're getting new gifts. Okay. Maybe you're tapping into a gift that you didn't know that you had at first. But I feel like you have this this mental clarity here. If you okay, for some of you, if you did some sort of magic, it worked. It's a big yes. So this could be confirmation for some of you. What's this Ace of Swords? <laughs> yeah, the moon reversed. Cancer Pisces. So something was revealed here. I don't know. Something could be being revealed through your intuition. Like maybe you're getting, you're becoming more sensitive to the energies. So you know when somebody doing something or when they're trying to like um, impede. Okay. What's the Ace of Swords with the moon reversed? So this is you moving away from like fear, doubt, worry, or stress. 
and you're doing something like with a clear head, a clear mind, you know what you want to manifest, you know what you want to do. Page of Swords here. So I feel like you're understanding that somebody or you're seeing somebody, either you're looking at somebody, watch somebody else, or you're seeing in the fact that they're spying on you here. Something has been revealed. Somebody has gotten some sort of like information. Okay, about a liar. Somebody got caught up in a lie. <laughs> oh, the high priestess reversed, seven of swords reversed, and the queen of swords reversed. A false high priestess. Somebody here could have gotten caught doing some sort of magic or somebody has found like evidence of somebody doing magic or looking at you. For some of you, I feel like somebody is seeing you seeing somebody watch you or something like that somebody has gotten either a download or somebody's going through like an awakening where they realize that somebody's a dark witch or whatever this is what's this page of swords okay this could be you speaking up about something something has been revealed something that somebody is looking for something that you said about somebody is turning out to be true okay knight of cups in the reverse yeah somebody's obsessed Knight of Cups in reverse is a troublemaker, someone that's obsessed or sleeping around, they're cheating. This could be like little petty ass gossip that somebody on or whatever. What's this? What's the um page of swords with the Knight of Cups reverse? This could also talk about too, somebody revoked their offer from someone and now they're looking at you. Somebody got their eyes on you here. Page of Pentacles, yeah, somebody's like watching Tarot <laughs> or they... They're getting into some sort of magic and they're, I don't know, they're awakening to something. You or this person. Five of Wands reversed. Yeah. So the ending of conflict here. Somebody's removing themselves from the drama, the conflict, or whatever this competition was. There's the end of it because somebody has gotten the truth. Somebody sees that somebody's trying to steal your identity or be you. I feel like somebody's trying to be you here, Leo. But there, there could be... A person that's interested in you, they're looking at you now because they see the truth. This person is looking at something that you do for work too. For some of you guys, you could be readers here. This person revoked their offer from you because maybe of, of what you do for work. But what you do for work is aligned with what they need to be doing for work or something like that. And they went towards somebody here. So they, they could have revoked their offer from you. Because you were a tarot reader or you were doing something spiritual and they, I guess they wasn't into it at that time because with the Knight of Cups reversed, they sleep. This person ain't tapping the shit that they need to tap into and they realizing that they revoked their offer from you. But whoever the fuck that maybe they did go towards someone, they were doing black magic behind their back to trick them, to make you look like you were the one doing something or it's like, it's like something like that. Something where this person was sleep. Or you were sleeping. Yeah. Yeah, this person. <laughs> yeah, they've been on a fake-ass journey this whole time. But it was meant for this person to do this for their growth. Three of Wands. It was meant for them to be imbalanced. To deal with whatever this is. So they can wake up. Because, I mean, you were trying to offer them something, I feel like. But they revoked. But you... But they they didn't take it or something like that. They had somebody around them causing trouble or being an obsessed loser. Or this person is saying that somebody's obsessed with you here. Somebody's trying to like plan your energy or some shit. Something about somebody's abilities. Yeah, Seven of Swords. Somebody's consciousness kicking in about all this dark shit that's going on. What's the magician? Yeah, the Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. Exactly. So somebody has clarity about a nine of pentacles reverse. Somebody that's a hoe, somebody that marries for money, they sleep around, they're a gold digger, they're untrustworthy, they got to depend on people for shit, they're a user. Somebody's an opportunist. What's the, what's the magician with the nine of pentacles reverse? Somebody's like putting the pieces of the puzzle together. <laughs> Go watch Virgo's reading. You could be on the cusp of Virgo. Six of swords. Yeah, two of cups. So yeah, somebody's accepting a lesson and they're departing from this nine of pentacles in the reverse. Somebody has clear a clear head about what this is. My nose is sorry. Yeah, and now something can move out of of a stalemate. 
somebody getting ready to seize an opportunity here for this love because they're waking up to it. It's it's a divine connection. Somebody was asleep. They were unaware of something. Yeah, they needed to awaken something in their intuition, about their intuition, their abilities, their gifts. They needed to awaken. Oh, this is you. You're taking your power back from somebody. What's the savage reverse? But this is somebody's like journey. They needed to go on this journey for healing purposes. Like it might sound fucked up, but that's what somebody's journey consists of. And everybody's journey different. So if this is your person, I feel like you should have some understanding. If you notice your masculine or your feminine. Especially if they're coming back changed and aware of what their purpose is with you. Like, you need to go ahead. But, yeah, so we have the Knight of Swords here. What's Savage here in the reverse with the Knight of Swords? So somebody is focused. Somebody does give a fuck. They're not going to be inconsiderate either. And acting ruthless, they're not doing that either. So what's Savage here with the Knight of Swords? Yeah, the Queen of Cups. Yeah, because they see that something is real love here. With the Knight of Swords and the Queen of Cups, somebody is like literally focused, they're headstrong, they're determined, they're they're being real serious. Okay, like Yeah, that's like a determined, driven, ambitious energy in this Knight of Swords. So there's some sort of big changes that are taking place. Okay, or somebody getting ready to seize an opportunity. What's this Knight of Swords? Yeah, Six of Cups. It's this person. Who just came on for like this? Yeah, Virgo. Go watch Virgo, Leo. Yeah, the Two of Cups. There's a reconciliation coming in fast, too. There's some sort of big changes that could just be happening with this union as a whole. But somebody is remembering you from their past life. Yeah, the Lovers and the Will of Fortune and the Justice, child. They're remembering you from their past life. They're remembering all this shit here. It's, I don't know if somebody's having past life dreams or what. But yeah, they recognize they with the wrong motherfucker. This queen of pentacles reverse and this fake ass family. Okay, and this dark magic using asshole. This is who the fuck been doing this damn dark magic to keep this person asleep and unaware. That's what the fuck they doing. And that, but I feel like this person realizes it now they see it. So what's this uh, queen of cups? Somebody's awakening to their gifts. Two, like major. <laughs> Somebody like, okay, the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. For some of you, somebody's aware too that somebody's attacking you as well. Like somebody, this could be a masculine here that's attacking you. Fuck is that noise? Probably my cat doing something. Somebody here is like heroic with the Knight of Swords. That's like heroic energy. That's like heroic energy. So somebody here is protecting you from something. I feel like Leo. Yeah, it's this Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. They're realizing like if they have somebody doing this shit to them, then what's happening to you? The same shit. Somebody is now stepping up to the plate because they realize that you've been being attacked this whole time. So this person is now doing the protecting. Okay. Knight of Pentacles in reverse is somebody that's superficial, money hungry. Um, this could be a masculine in your life here, uh, uh Leo. For the for the feminines. What's the Queen of Cups with the Knight of Pentacles reverse? Yeah, the yeah, there you are, Leo. Knight of Pentacles in reverse too is somebody that can't finish what they started because somebody now is strong enough to fight this war. Whatever this mess is. The, the shrimp card talks about having confidence to overcome the challenges here that you're faced with. Inner confidence, strength, boldness, courageousness. Okay, yeah. Seven of Wands reverse, Five of Swords reverse, Ten of Cups reverse. Yeah, okay. I feel like you've overcame this too. Like you fought your battles too. This person is doing the same thing. Y'all both protecting each other now, I feel. 
Now that both of y'all have awakened or something like that. What's the SOS here? Yep. The Ten of Swords in reverse. Yeah, now so now everybody rushing around because they need they need to they like, okay, something is 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 different. The energy is different. Something is, is over. Yeah, it is, bitch. The hex, the curse, the whatever this is, somebody has overcame it. It's over with. It's done. <laughs> some of you guys y'all did something to stop this shit honey this shit is powerful whatever the fuck you did it worked like a charm somebody here knows the worst is yet to come for their ass somebody could actually be going to the hospital because something that they did to end something it was horrible so whatever the fuck they get back i feel like it's gonna definitely close out a cycle with the world what's the sos here with the ten of swords reverse <laughs> Because that's like Gemini Sun here. Okay, the full reverse. Yeah, somebody made a dumbass decision. This was stupid as fuck here. This could be you taking action or doing something. I don't know. But something is now moving forward. Somebody can see something clear as fuck. Like, clear as day. I don't know what the fuck you did. <laughs> somebody did something. But the, the full in reverse is reckless energy. It's like a distraction. Whatever this distraction was, it's over with. Somebody here made a dumbass decision. What's the Ten of Swords reverse? The Ace of Cups. What's Ten of Swords reverse, Ace of Cups? The Eight of Pentacles. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, the, 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 there's focus here. The Ace of Cups here with the Eight of Pentacles. There's a gift here. You're very creative. Very, very creative, very hardworking. I feel like you're very committed to something. You could be committed to a relationship that's coming in. You're committed to this love, this connection, or you're committed to whatever this is about your work. Like, you're very skilled at it. <laughs> okay, whatever the fuck this is. You could have done something here to break this damn hex, this curse. It worked. Okay, this reading could be confirmation for somebody. Now somebody here could be, I don't know, they could be sick. If you broke this hex, I mean, the energy got to go back from somewhere. Bounce off you. It's going back on them, ain't it? Like, you could have just did a hex-breaking ritual or something like that. You probably didn't even need to do a return to sender or anything. You just broke the hex. And now it's going back on their ass. And I just feel like, oh, well, shouldn't have did it. Why the fuck you do that shit anyway? So, so you can have Virgo in your chart or you could be on the cusp. Go watch Virgo for sure. So, I feel like you back-focused or you did something here. That I feel like you already automatically, this is already embedded in your DNA. You're already skilled at something. You're this powerful. And it might look like something little that you did. But honey, it shook some shit up over there, wherever they at. <laughs> like, it just, yeah, death card here. Nine of cups reverse, nine of wands. Yeah, you're releasing nine, nine, nine. You're almost at the end of something. Definitely going through a transformation here, death and a rebirth. This shit is ending. Whatever this warfare is, I feel like nine of wands is you being protected. <laughs> this is protection. Nine of cups in the reverse. Yeah, so somebody's wish is shattered. They ass is sitting up here miserable, unhappy, sad, broken, fucked up, whatever the fuck this is. Uh, Queen of swords reverse, king of wands reverse. It could be a lot of motherfuckers that was doing some shit. This shit is over with. This <laughs> is done. What's the full reverse? What's the full reverse? So now something is progressing, it's moving forward. Okay, yeah. Or you're making progress with whatever work that you know how to do, honey. But yeah, the Five of Cups. What's the full reverse Five of Cups? So somebody got sad and depressed and upset, so they decided to do something risky by conjuring up some shit that they didn't need to do. I don't know. Scorpio Venus here, Seven of Cups reverse. I'm hearing the word retaliation. Yeah, somebody want to get back so bad. Okay, well, you got it. You got to get back. You got exactly what the fuck you gave. You got it back. <laughs> okay, whatever the fuck you sent out is going back. So enjoy. Mm -hmm. Enjoy, shit face. <laughs> okay. I'm trying to look at something. Hold on here.
Seven of Cups reverse is a missed opportunity. It's like being trapped and and um they in for a rude awakening. They know this shit. But it's like feeling trapped or stuck or um this could also talk about too um missed opportunity. Somebody is working with a dark, like they working with something really dark. Whoever this is. And then they sit back and wait to see if something gonna work. A bitch, it's not. This is really not. This person here so they so it's like they working with something dark. They're working with a dark de like a, a deity for dark purposes or a, a specific ancestor of theirs. Yeah, the devil and the emperor reversed. Whoever this is, like possess themselves to do certain things. Or they they like, I don't know. It's like really weird. This emperor reversed the devil and the, the tower. This person is very obsessive, very dark. Because I'm looking at my King of Cups in the reverse. That's in the reverse. I say um, my Spirit Guide card. When it's in the reverse, though, that's a dark entity for me sometimes. When I see this kind of shit in the reading. And that's exactly what the fuck it is. The tower. Yeah, they getting ready to go through a tower. Because whatever this entity is, getting ready to go back. And they're not going to be able to handle it either. This person is obsessive. Very obsessive. Very dark. Could be somebody's child's father or some shit. They they work with lower vibrational uh entities and shit like that to um send out to you to cause confusion. Child. <laughs> what what else? What's sorry, not sorry. I'm remorseful. Yeah, I feel like you you tired of being nice and all this shit. I feel like you did something with kindness. You did it with love. Like, bitch, yeah, I, I'm done. I don't want to. I just want you to leave me the fuck alone. Yeah, the seven of pentacles. What's the, yeah, four of cups reversed. <laughs> What's the sorry, not sorry with the seven of pentacles? Or this is their whole ass. They don't want to be sorry for something. And that's fine. Yeah, the ace of wands. The ace of wands and the seven of pentacles. I feel like this is you. Getting ready to get ready to go have fun. Some of y'all going on a vacation, you traveling, or you investing into something. Whatever this is, this passion, this gift, or whatever the fuck you're doing. Or this could be you on something new and long. Okay, you on something new and long and thick. Okay. <laughs> a masculine, maybe they saying shit. I'm not sorry, bitch. Move out of my way. Yeah, this King of Wands reverse and all that. Queen of Swords reverse. Yeah. Death card. Fuck all that. You in my way. Now you getting in my way here. I'm awake now, so you can move. You did what you needed to do. This person is healing. Get on, bitch. I feel like that's what you're saying. Take your entity and go. <laughs> go on, because that's your entity now. They ain't got no host to live in over here. You're the host. And you need to take, take your entity and your ass on somewhere. Bye. Have fun with it. Real shit. I feel like that's what you're saying. That's what you're saying. But the Seven of Pentacles here, Ace of Wands, is an investment. This is you getting ready to like, I don't know. Let's see. What's the Ace of Wands? What's this? You could be getting ready to invest in something creative. Okay, Three of Wands here. Yeah, growth. Some of y'all getting ready to travel. Is what I'm getting. And the temperance in the reverse. And I feel like you're doing it and you're comfortable with doing it too. I don't give a fuck. This person with their narcissistic ass, I feel like you don't give a fuck about them being mad or any of that. Fuck them. Keep trying to control your life and all that, bitch. You ain't got no control over shit that you doing with your stupid ass. That's why this damn entity getting ready to get your ass. <laughs> getting ready to get you, bitch. But the temperance reverse. Yeah, so somebody here is moving away from an antagonist. Some sort of discord, disharmony. Yeah, they doing this shit with confidence too. Somebody is moving or something. Or your something is growing, it's expanding. Your ships are coming in with the three of wands. I feel like there's a lot of like passion and excitement coming in for you. Temperance in the reverse is some shit that you're leaving behind. Somebody realizing the grass is greener. <laughs> That's what they realize it. The grass is greener. I'm coming back to get my baby. Fuck that. I'm awake now. Fuck all that. What's the seven of pentacles? 
Ooh, this is Seven of Pentacles. And they doing this shit without a care in the world. They like, yeah, y'all gonna get the fuck out of my way. Yeah, the Wheel of Fortune child and the judgment. They like, yeah, this is part of my purpose. You getting ready to move. Oh, this you getting ready to say, yeah, I'm just getting ready to do this shit. This is what I'm supposed to be doing. I feel it. I know it. So let me go ahead and tap into it or whatever this is. Okay, so I'm in my bag. <laughs> okay, yeah, three of cups. So there's like good fortune coming in. This is like really good energy. Good fortune, good karma, luck, blessings. With the judgment here, this is like a karmic test, a karmic lesson that's been learned, I feel. You cleared out some sort of karma with the judgment and the will. Okay, this is a lot of karmic debt being paid and you paid it off. So now your inheritance is coming in, Seven of Pentacles. There's a certain investment you're getting ready to make that's going to lead you to a lot of success. <laughs> like somebody feel like maybe you avoiding accountability or you it's like no i took accountability bitch you avoid you the one avoiding it that's why your ass stuck right now what's the temperance in the reverse <sighs> you the one avoiding it i just don't give a fuck no more i'm leaving and i'm not remorseful about shit and i'm fucking i'm the neg i am neglecting the responsibility that you think i have to you bitch because it's not you know i ain't got the I, you're somebody's entitled and i just feel like no so yeah the seven of wands in reverse what's the temperance reverse seven of wands reverse somebody here is burnt the fuck out they burnt out they tired they weak as fuck they ain't got no backbone they ain't got no defense they ain't got no fucking protection they lost their protection all this shit is gone yeah ten of pentacles reversed somebody here is faking their wealth or yeah they care a lot about how they look page of cups reverse king of pentacles reverse six of wands reverse to a whole fucking community that don't give a fuck about them they all got ill intentions towards they ass but this could be like a smear cane i said smear cane <laughs> a smear campaign or people that this person then rallied up here then slept with with the page of cups in reverse a lot of promiscuity or whatever this is now they got to keep up appearances with nothing because they don't have your energy to use anymore to keep up the appearances Somebody's a loser. Okay. Them and they flying monkeys. That's what the fuck this is. Ten of Pentacles reverse is instability. It's a whole empire. A whole business is falling apart. Everybody losing shit. Because it's all about you. Somebody here was stealing. Your energy. Stealing your inheritance. All that stupid ass shit. Yeah, you're taking back your energy. You're now in the Seven of Pentacles building. Something is progressing for you. Eight of Pentacles. And the Ten of Pentacles is what was built over there. You're taking your energy back. And so you starting from the Eight or Seven of Pentacles and you getting ready to be up to the damn Nine and Ten. Okay, just period. Yeah, because that shit ain't cool. Mm -mm. These are motherfuckers that want to keep up appearances, bitch. Which then keep it up then. Hopefully you can keep it up when I leave. <laughs> Because it don't look like you will be. Motherfuckers over here fighting about money and all kind of stupid shit. Somebody's moving away from this dysfunction. They surrendering this shit completely. <laughs> like they don't give a fuck about the arguing, the fussing, the fighting. They don't give a fuck. The antagonism. It's like they just completely focused on one thing. Or a couple things. You got three aces in this thing right here on the spread. Somebody got clarity. They opening their hearts here. Somebody's doing the inner work to open their heart. They focus on their work, focus on their crafts, and they're getting ready to travel and do whatever they whatever their passion is. Whatever your passion is, it's a part of your purpose. They're going to go do it. Whether it be about work or your love life. And you mean it. <laughs> okay. Like ain't nobody stopping you or anything like that. You have too much confidence. Somebody realizes they ain't got no protection where they at. Like, they they just, everything falls apart where they're at. And it's time to go. Give me some here for Leo. Self-awareness is key. Take time today to go within and spend some time with your soul. Go for a walk in nature and ground yourself. Meditate. Listen to your favorite mu music. Whatever you enjoy most, do that today. Yeah, somebody getting ready to live their life and not just exist anymore. It's time to stop just existing and live your fucking life. Resilience is one of the strongest qualities you have. It has gotten you through so many trials and tribulations in the past, and it will continue to do so. Lean on that inner tower of strength anytime that you need it. You got this. Yeah. And do. 
2002, The Void, Longing, Technology, Ambition, Genius, Forward Thinking, Stress, and Depression. Mm. You have more control over your life than you realize. Learn and execute what interests you. Turn things around. It gets better with time. There are plenty of friends to make, so chill out, have fun, and open up. Go outside. So for some of you guys, you do need to go outside. Maybe there's a lack of fun. You could be getting ready to take a vacation or something. Go on a vacation, travel. It's like more to see than this lame shit here with your family or whoever these hoes are fighting about money. So it says, when there are questions you need assistance with, go inward. Sit with yourself, meditate on the question, ask for our help also. Then trust your intuition as most often the answer and guidance will be delivered to you intuitively. We are with you always. Yeah, somebody here is, is working on a self-awareness. They are self-aware and they're getting in, uh, clarity through their uh, intuition. Yeah. Or oh, this is you. Three, 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 social skills, hope, optimism, liberation, success, prosperity, excitement, and enthusiasm. The problems you have today will eventually disappear. Your guardian angels encourage you to maintain a positive outlook on life since your luck may be about to change. It is time to put to use your captivating energy and inspirational personality. Don't let your ego get the best of you. And then we have where you are right now is where you are supposed to be. Don't compare yourself to others. That only adds pressure. Take each day as it comes and for what it is. You are a better person than you were yesterday. Growth isn't necessary. Growth isn't easy, but you got this. Growth is definitely necessary. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Go back to the heart of who you truly are. There you will find peace. Look at your life in its entirety. Acknowledge any old wounds and then release them. Use what they taught you as added strength. Keep moving forward with a renewed sense of confidence. So, yes. If you're doing something good, Leo, I'm very proud of you. I feel like I'm talking to a man, but... Mm -hmm. So, this was your reading. Okay, I hope this resonated for y'all. Like, comment, subscribe, turn your notification bell on, press the all button so you guys don't miss my reads. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.